Hello there, my spooky, scary skeletons. It's Chloe in Real Life, your guide to the ghoulish, your share of the spook, and a fan of all things frightful. Welcome back to Spooky Saturdays. Now, I don't know how the weather's been for you guys, but over where I live, it's been kind of chilly and a little overcast and rainy, which in California, that is pretty rare. But I am quite the fan of the gloomy and dark weather. So I decided to celebrate. I needed some comfort food. And what a better way to celebrate with a warm, nice latte. But this isn't just any latte. Oh no. This, as you can see, is a black latte. Let's see how I made this. So the things you are going to need for your black latte is, of course, activated charcoal. Now this is what is going to make it actually turn black, but you want to make sure that you get the food grade activated charcoal because if you don't, well then you can't really drink your latte. You can get a milk frother, but I heard that you can also use a blender, but I just thought that this would be easier. Almond milk, a, table, a teaspoon, uh, a glass mug so you can see your latte and then finally some vanilla extract so let's make it so the first step is you're going to add three cups of almond milk to your pan and i already got vanilla uh, almond milk so i'm only adding one teaspoon of vanilla extract and now it is time to add our activated charcoal and we just need to stop and take a minute. Look at that, it is just so beautiful. You know I love the color black, it is my favorite color. And this is just like looking into just darkness and it's so, it's so pretty. So we're just gonna add one tablespoon, or teaspoon, sorry. So we're just gonna add one teaspoon of the activated charcoal. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. So now I'm just gonna whisk this up and then take it to the stove and heat it up. So now that the, all the ingredients are mixed together, we're gonna take it over to the stove and heat it till it's warm all the way through. So the white frothing foam didn't really work, but the gray did. And I think it looks super good. Now we are gonna take a little bit of our activated charcoal and make a little bit of a topper. You're gonna take the smallest bit for this part, guys. And then you're just going to Just a real quick disclaimer before I try this, activated charcoal is a detoxifier and what that means is it removes all the toxins out of your body. They'll use it a lot in hospitals if there's an overdose or if there's poisoning, any kind of that, because uh, it will flush it out of your system. So just be weary if you're taking any medication or vitamins, it is recommended to 
take your vitamins or medication two hours before you consume anything with activated charcoal um, because it'll flush it out of your system and then there'll be no point to the medication or vitamins. And so, yeah, just a little disclaimer, but be sure to check with your doctor just to make sure if it messes with anything you're doing. <laughs> So I got my activated charcoal off Amazon and I will be putting the link in the description. And activated charcoal actually has a lot of uses. I got mine that is food grade and like I said, it's a detoxifier, but a lot of other people use it for teeth whitening or skin care. But right now, all the benefits of activated charcoal are going into this awesome black latte. So let's give it a taste it is so pretty i like don't even want to drink it but i do because it's gonna be really tasty i'm so scared it's gonna be really hot mm. okay okay it's hot it is it is hot it's hot so be cautious when drinking your latte wow that is super super tasty it has the nice almond milk taste and with the vanilla almond milk and the teaspoon of vanilla ac extract, I think it made the perfect amount of vanilla where it was just kind of subtle but it wasn't too overpowering and the activated charcoal has no taste whatsoever. I thought that it was kind of going to have a taste but it, it doesn't have a taste at all and it looks awesome. But this is super tasty. And also, side note, almond milk is super good. Oh my goodness, like this is really tasty. You could, I guess, make it with normal milk, but almond milk is the way to go. So I got sweetened vanilla almond milk, but I saw also you could get unsweetened almond milk. And I think that would be good if you don't like stuff that's too sweet. I personally don't think this is very sweet, but you could add a sweetener and make it your level of sweetness. If you like a lot of sweetness, just a little bit of sweetness, you can really customize it to how you like it. But this is super tasty. And I forgot to mention that this is an all almond milk latte, but you could add coffee and it would be delicious and amazing and fantastic. And it would probably even make it a darker shade of black. So, for all my spooky skeletons out there who can't really handle the bitterness of black coffee but still want the color, just add some activated charcoal and almond milk and you're good to go. So, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like, a comment, and don't forget to subscribe and be sure to hit the notification bell so you're notified every time I upload a spooky video just like this one. And be sure to comment down below if you make this because I want to know. I'll see you all next time. Bye. Stay spooky. Are you this drink? Because I love you a latte.